so it is what is it Wednesday June 1st happy June I want to start this vlog up outside because it's absolutely beautiful I don't want any makeup on but I'm going to get uh, my clean teeth clean I'm going to a dentist appointment and I have a few things going on today so I did want to vlog and it's a beautiful day you guys know I love when the sun's out so let's go get some teeth clean so little update on the refeed. I woke up feeling pretty bloated, like really bloated. Maybe just because of the excess sodium, I did take in a lot of sodium. I take in a lot of sodium on the daily, but yesterday my sodium level was like 3,000 milligrams and that's pretty high and including all the carbs. So my body is holding on to a lot of water. So that is what is going on as far as the refeed. All right, so I'm going to get to the dentist now, and then I, it's like 9.30, I probably get a coffee, and then I will eat breakfast and then get to work for the day. So I got my Starbucks. I finished off at the dentist. It's my teeth. And it uh, feels good to like, get that cleaned. And I went by my dad's, gave him a coffee, picked up some money. I actually picked up the credit card. And I have to get some stuff for my trip when I leave on Saturday. And then I'm gonna go by my grandmom's now. She picked up some food for me, so that's what I'm gonna be doing. My breakfast here I have 100 grams of rice cauliflower I have three egg whites 24 grams of reduced sugar ketchup 17 grams of cookie butter cream cheese one slice of Eureka bread and two ounces of Canadian style turkey bacon all right, so I just got off the phone with a client called, her name is Kelly and my client Jessica actually referred her and She's going to be a lifestyle client, so I'm really excited to have her. She seems super sweet on the phone and just excited about getting healthier, getting more on a... Sorry. <coughs> 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 I just had like a coughing attack, but um... She seemed really excited about getting healthier, being on a more like rigid plan as far as working out because she always feels like she goes into the gym and she's not really sure what to do. She, she would like a plan that's more detailed and gives her more structure. So that's as far as that, but we talked about the flexibility of the diet and how it's macronutrient based and she seemed really excited about that. And I told her I'm here to help you learn. Ooh, something's like caught in my throat. I told her I'm here to help you learn and really learn from me and take this as far as you want with me and I want her if when she is done or when she feels like she is ready to go off on her own just to feel like she's comfortable and has learned a lot. And I've also just got a check-in from one of my bikini clients. She's down three pounds within one week. She's been losing about a pound or two a week and she's three weeks out, so her weight loss is like really, really rapid. I have her refeeding once a week, so it's really like picking up and I'm super proud of her. So she's three weeks out, which is really close to her show and um, I'm just really excited. So I have a lot of like great emails. I have some brand new clients and I'm really, just feeling all good feels right now and um as far as reefy yesterday so i feel like i have a ton of energy from all the carbs and just all good feels so i just eat my ate my breakfast i'm going to edit a video and get to more programs and then i don't know i'll be working out today obviously but jess is not coming with me because she has an art class so I'll just be running solo i'm doing some cardio 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 and then that will be it so I just wanted to include that, that I was really excited about having her and getting like positive emails this morning that always like makes my day and it makes me proud to do what I do. Look who surprisingly came in. I'm editing a YouTube video and all of a sudden I hear the door open and I thought like somebody was about to come and hurt me. <laughs> so come and steal me and she surprisingly came home. Say hello. Look how pretty she looks. Oh no. 
Well, we get to work together because I'm working and she's gonna work. So that's pretty cool how she came home today. I had no idea. She didn't even call me. So great surprise. So, so it's like. 2.30, 2.40 or something like that. And I'm making a stop to Target because I have to get a few things for my trip as I'm getting in the car. So I have to get like some oats, I have to get some water, like different things. So I'm gonna get that. And I have Jess with me now. She just came up from school. Hi. And I have to get some of the lady products for my mama. And then, uh, I don't know, just gotta get, make sure I get uh, everything for my trip. So that's really what I'm And we try to find for. something that's really good. <laughs> we always find new things. But yeah. yeah, so we're gonna do a Target run and I'm gonna take you guys with me. So I found this bathing suit. I got this, like a uh, no sleeve, whatever it's called. <laughs> and bikini. yeah, bikini, but, and I got the yes. Can you get this in a little? Sure. Good too. We also got some freezer bags, some storage bags, especially when traveling, always using Ziploc bags. Got some iced coffee, shampoo. Yeah. All right, so you go to Target for a couple things and you leave with everything, basically. So, additions. We have some white chocolate macadamia nut, coffee, some wonton strips. We have cinnamon roll, um, whatever it is, oatmeal. <laughs> like, what am I saying right now? And we got a new thing of bread, it's only 12 grams of carbs per slice. And just some other junk, because we buy everything. Finest. We have the flatbread, zucchini, cheese, the wontons, seven grams of that, uh, 160 grams of asparagus, two ounces of chicken. So this is a huge meal, um, very low carb, but it's a, it'll fill me up for a few hours before I go train. Just got a package from Arctic Zero. Arctic Zero hooked it up. Nice packaging, and they wrote Spanish the Power on there, so that's pretty personalized. So, pamphlet. Woo! Let's see. We got banana pudding. Oh, I like that. Ooh, banana pudding. I'm gonna have that. Poppin' pomegranate. That's my favorite. Cake batter. Mommy's favorite. Brownie batter. <gasps> my favorite. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Wait, how much is the brown? I'm gonna have the brownie. Snickerdoodle! Mom's favorite. I don't eat on any of these flavors that are a thing, so I am so happy. Thank you, Arctic Zero, for, uh, for this. This is so amazing, and I will definitely post about it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. The gym now, and I'm wearing a just black tank top and some Nike pants and Nike shoes, so Nike, Nike. And hitting the gym alone today because she's going to an art class. And I'm going to be doing some shoulders and arms and 25 minutes of HIIT cardio.
All right, just got home from my shoulder and cardio session. I'm gonna be honest, the last thing, oh, sorry guys. The last thing I wanted to do was sprints, but I told myself like I could do this, I gotta get this done, and there's just no way I'm not gonna get it done. So I always say there's no option, there's only option to do. There's not an option to fail, there's no option not to do. So I told myself I could do this, and I plowed through my sprints today, and I felt really good. So I got a good session at 7.44, I'm gonna eat my post-workout shake, and then I'll probably eat dinner, and then a dessert, so I have like a lot of things <laughs> planned. But since I did work out late, I can eat later at night. I space my carbs around my workout, so I'll eat within a three hour window um, after I do work out, and then after that I just stop, and then again, like I go into like a 12 hour fast, so I do like intermittent fasting. And um, it definitely helps with fat burning zones and um, keeping your metabolism high, so that's what I do. And I just wanted to mention that if you're struggling with like sprints, any type of cardio exercise, just like get in the zone and tell yourself uh, what I did actually, it's a little pro tip. I stopped the belt like halfway and then I restarted so that way I was like, okay, I got through 15 minutes, I stopped it, restarted it, then I was like, all right, I have to just do 15 minutes more. So it didn't feel like, oh, well, I did 10 minutes more, 25 minutes. And so I, I didn't feel like as long. So it's just like a little tip, if you could try that out, just mentally, just get you through it easier. Um, hope you guys find that helpful. So I got my shake here, just Quest and unsweetened cashew milk, and then I just topped it with the Puff Kamut. All right, so for tonight's ice cream bowl, I have 132 grams of Halo Top vanilla bean ice cream. I have 120 grams of Arctic Zero sea salt caramel. 10 grams of Honey O's Cheerios, 30 grams of Icon Meals Vanilla Peanut Butter Popcorn, and I'm gonna top it with 16 grams of Barney Butter Almond Butter. Yes!